Rio Hibar. This is about three or four K below the confluence. Been just continuous class two and then building to three. Down to this little bridge point. I haven't really gotten out to scout at all. One right above here is about a good class three. After about a dozen class four or five rapids, there's an easier section. That's a couple kilometers. This is still above Hacienda Viejo. And we came to this uh, left turn. Great big class five minus rapid. No real big dangers here, but. Woo! After portages five and six, those are, you can see them in the last picture. We got this one here. Uh oh. There he's going right where he should, though. <laughs> Good. Looks like it opens up down there. We had a few threes before that little trip came out on River Right. And another couple threes, good ones, before this one, first four. Set out to set on the right. Pretty clean walk. Well, after the Ver Venado confluence, we came through a few class three, three to four drops, and this is another one. Kind of in gorgy territory. This one, we had to get out and scout. The others, we could both scout. Craig's taking a right line down here, which looks a little easier to him. A lot of more stuff down there. First big rapid on the Rio Toro. Kind of like a class three plus. Big class five rapid. We just went on the river so far. There's the there's just two rapids down from the class five going into a gorge where there's a nice bridge. Kind of a class four, easy four. Oh, we went through about six more class fours. This is a real big one we had to get out and scout. Just fun. Woo! No problem. Line down the center. Limestone continues. And the action does not stop. Bestias. the line. We'll see how Greg does in it. Nice. Good class four section here. Several kilometers down from Los Amates. Kind of slate boulders now, some different stuff. This 
a tricky four plus, five minus type section. Shout out to Stout on River Left. See the rest of it down there. Some more class four drops. 